you know, I'm a pirate now. Pirate's life for me and stuff. Na 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 na. Na 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 na. Pirate's life. You want to build a boat like this? Stick around, guys, because I'm about to show you. Hey, what's up, you guys? We're here in the early morning in Ark uh, to make a raft and to make a beautiful one. Uh, I haven't seen any videos on YouTube yet on how to make a beautiful raft. But first, I want to fill you in on some other stuff that I did. I've gotten 14 levels up since last episode. Uh, the server went down every 15 minutes or so, so I couldn't really uh, make a video without you know losing the files and stuff like that uh, so basically what I did is every time I could be online I leveled up a bit uh, I have some new uh, teams here I got a scorpion which is a level up right now let's see here let's go some health uh, he's level 67 his name is stinger but it's female <laughs> and uh, I got a pteranodon level 145 now I got him down with trank arrows. Uh, one trank arrow on level like, I think I was level 30 something. One trank arrow is not enough for this guy. I had to shoot it in the face, get on my raptor, follow it around until it landed again and then shoot it again. And I had to do that about four times I think. So that took quite a while. Uh, let's see, we're just gonna, I think we're just gonna get some moving speed on him or something. Now let's give him some health. So yeah, we got that guy, which is amazing, and his name is Easy Times. Reason being, uh, once you get a flying bird thing in Ark, uh, Ark becomes a lot easier, basically. So we got that going. I got a few dodos, uh, two females, for the eggs. Um, let's see here. We had the raptors. Oh, I got a max level compi. There he is. His name is Chompers. Or is it a her? No, it's a is a guy. His name is Chompers, and it's a level 120 uh, perfect team. I uh, I fought the group off, and this guy was still alive, and I noticed it was level 120. So what I did is I would just run back to the base, got some narcotics, and uh, killed some stegos and stuff like that to get some prime meat, and it was uh, quite an easy team actually. So yeah, we got that guy, which is amazing. We also got some metal stuff going. I did quite a few things. <laughs> we got the sickle, we got the bike. Uh, I still got to make some crossbows though, but I do like the bows a lot, so I, I'm not in a hurry with that. Anyways, to the point here. We're making a raft. Um, as you could see, it's going to be a really nice looking one, and uh, I'll show you this just as a spoiler. I have filled the build two times. There's two rafts over there, two boats. Uh, they didn't turn out the way I wanted them, uh, want them to be, so um, yeah, it's just a lot of levels up, basically. I got some new stuff here. I got the trikes full of wood and thatch and stuff like that. I made some stuff, so basically uh, that's where all the levels come from. Now, let's make the raft first. I think I got the stuff with me, yet. Yeah. There we go. And I'm going to show you guys how to make it in uh, the shape that it is, with the pointy front. You know, it looks like a real boat. And, you know, in the light that I haven't seen any other videos on Ark. Hey, we got level 45. No, 40. 40 is good. Let's see here. What do we want? Well, we're building. Let's take carry weight. Oh, man, level 40. Let's Let's go have a look here. Because I really want the ghillie suit, and to get the ghillie suit, you need um, you need to smack down some penguins. And the only place the penguins can be found is actually in the actual snow biome. So we're gonna need a boat for that. Uh, but I can finally make the gauntlets and the boots, so that's great. What else? I can make a spider saddle, mammoth, ankylo, oh, and we can make all the fabricator stuff. 
that's really cool. We're gonna be doing that soon. Uh, I think when we're when we're gonna go to the snow, uh, snow biome to get the ghillie suit stuff, uh, organic polymer. We're gonna tame a mammoth while we're there, and maybe some penguins. And we're gonna be making a long neck rifle pretty soon. So that's uh, that's the next few episodes probably. But first, the raft. What we want to do is hide this hill because that seal looks stupid let's see here you're gonna need uh, to start off with you're gonna need like three foundations no five actually uh, let's just there we go five foundations you're gonna need a lot of fence foundations so let's take eight of those we're gonna need some ceilings and some walls and that's about it this is really to, to get the point on the ship you're gonna need this stuff not exact, exactly like 12 walls or something, but just get a few of those and uh, then you can start off with this. Now, the most important part, I think, of this build, I'm, go I'm just going to put all my stuff in, in the Scorpion. It's going to, you know, that's 10 kilograms, that's 7, that's another 7. Why isn't it? There we go. So let's just dump all the heavy stuff. That's fine. There you go. Now the most important stuff of this build is placing this first foundation in the correct position and as straight as you can get it. Because if you don't do that, the entire boat is going to be crooked. And it's already going to be crooked a little bit from, you know, bugging these diagonal walls in there. So we're going to have to get this straight. And I do that by putting it on this ledge here that's sticking out and then just trying to get it in. Like, do you see the left part? That left part has to be exactly in the same place as the right and the middle one. So we're going to have to turn it a little bit. There you go. And then step back. Step forward. Just a little bit more. This is pretty good. We can move it to the middle. The middle part is where the sill comes out. You're going to want your foundation there. Let's see if we can get it straight. I'm not going to touch my mouse. There we go, let's just place it like this. And it's really straight now. There's there's no arguing that. So what we can do next is get these foundation in, uh, foundations in there. Let's just put all this stuff on the bar. There we go. Now you can place these foundations here. If you place it like I just did, uh, you're not going to have any problems with placing the other two next to it. So next thing you do is you put some ceilings down and you put another three ceilings in front of that now this is gonna cost a lot of materials just to make that pointy pointy bit at the front it's gonna cost you this in materials but you know it's worth it now for the for the hard part and this is really the hardest part uh, we're gonna have to place these um, wall foundations and what we want to do is place them at the outside here why the outside uh, I tried it on the inside and when you get to that point here where they come together they actually cross each other and you're not allowed to put any walls on there I think happened so let's put it like come on there we go let's put it like that and then, for the real hard part, we're going to have to get it diagonal. So it's going to have to snap to that other one there. And there we go. That actually went a lot easier than uh, I expected it to, uh, to go. Normally you're struggling with this quite a, quite a bit. Now, before you continue, you've got one in there diagonally now. Before you do anything else, you're going to have to check if your wall is going to be the right way around. So basically, this one isn't. This one's gonna face the outside with the inside part, if that makes any sense. So we don't want that, so we're gonna have to redo this one. And instead of standing here, what we did, we're gonna stand on this side, and it should make a difference. But it's really hard to get it in now, I think. Oh, there we go. That wasn't hard at all. And it's still the wrong way around. Yeah, so... We're going to do it even 
from this side, and we're we're just gonna repeat that process until it until we get it right. Why isn't it? Why is Ark being such a? Oh, I know what happened there. I know what's going on. This one's the wrong way around. Is it? No, it's not. Oh, Ark. Sometimes. Why? Why are you doing this? I really want to go like this, because maybe that will help. I just don't want to fall out, fall off the boat. Let's try that. Let's go here. Because I know you guys are going to say you can just press E like that and it's going to face the outside. Sure, you can do that. But there's going to be gaps in your walls because when you place this wall and then you're going to place that one next, it's going to, it's not going to snap to each other. It's, it's going to leave a hole in there. So you, you really don't want that. So let's just get this in there. Oh, is it facing, was it facing the right way? I think it was for a second. No, it must must be in my imagination. Anyways, you just want to do this before you do anything else. You want to get these walls straight. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to get them straight and we'll be right back with you guys. And we're back guys. I got them in and the reason that they weren't snapping the right way around is because these are not supposed to be on the outside but on the inside. Kind of made a mistake there. I'm sorry about that. But um, you should place them in here. If you do that, this one is going to snap the right way around. Like that. And you've got the wood sticking out. And on the other side I already did it. The same thing. So now for the real hard part here. Because um, you're going to have to place another one diagonal to that one. But there's like a crossing of ceilings here so you got basically this ceiling that ceiling that ceiling and they're all gonna it's all it's gonna want to snap to every single one of them so you really got to play around with your with your camera here and just hope that you get it to go towards you so let's do that let's try and get that thing in there which is really hard oh we had it for a second it's around here. There we go. No, 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 no. I should press it as soon as I see it. Because if you wait too long, it's going to try and snap to another place. I don't know why it does that, but... Wait, there it is, there it is. Let's... There we go. Is that the right way around? Yes, it is. So we got those facing the outside. Now you're going to do this one. Get that in there. See, oh, there we go. That went a lot easier. Now, as you can see here, at the point, you're gonna have uh, them, they're not touching each other, yeah? And there's nothing you can do about that. Like, you know, having a, bo having a pointy boat is amazing on its own. And you're gonna have to live with this that, um, you know, you, you can't have. You, you can't have the walls touching each other there. You're going to have to live with that. I fixed that by pl placing a wall here. If you do that, uh, it's not going to be obvious that they're not touching each other. So, uh, you know, but you'll see that later. Now, what we can do this uh, at this point is we can just remove these ceilings. And every everything is just going to be a good guy and stay floating in the air. Come on. Oh, there we go. See that? They just stay in there. Now, these ceilings are in there because it, it does cross the ceiling a little bit. So, just as, you know, an insurance that nothing's gonna go wrong. I place the ceilings in there. And we can just remove all this stuff here. And it's just gonna stay in the air, floating. So, it's uh, that's really great. For some reason, they're being supported by something. Probably by the foundation here. And... It, it, it's already looking very good. See that? that? Now that's the shape of a real boat. I wish it was, you know, a normal option to just place them like that. Now for the next part. you, th I think you can actually remove these on the foundation. And you're going to want to do that. You're going to want to remove these fence foundations. And it's just going to stay there. We just needed those fence foundations so it would snap. 
uh, so you could place them diagonal the uh, diagonal so you can just remove those because if you build a wall on those fence foundations uh, your boat whatever you build on it is going to be crooked from that point on so you're going to want to build it on the foundation itself if you build it like that there's not going to be any problems with you know placing a door in there or whatever so next thing next thing I'm going to show you here you can place walls on this and as you can see there's a hole that's something you're gonna have to live with really it's it's you know the only drawback about this build and we can actually place walls underneath it too let's see here I'm a bit heavy so I'm going really slow there we go you can place that there if I can manage it there you go we can just fill this stuff up here come on Because at that point where you, if you place this wall, it's not actually snapping to this uh, fence foundation anymore, but it's snapping to the wall above it. So you're, you're, you're going to end up with this as a pointy front of your boat. And that already looks a lot better than, than the normal boats do, you know, being all square and stuff like that. So um, yeah, we got that done. That done. That's, that's great. Now there's another thing. We got this here. You can make two choices. You can either go out, go outside of your boundaries even further and make the point even bigger, but you're going to run into a hell of a lot of trouble. And I mean, really, you just don't want to do that, right? You want to keep it like this, because if you keep it this wide, it's going to look okay lengthwise. Uh, you know the proportions of the boat if you make it even wider than this uh, It's it's just gonna look like a fat boat that was in a crash or something like that So we're not gonna be doing that. I do want to place. I don't have any stuff with me. Let's see here I, I'm just gonna get some stuff because I want to build oh, We're not allowed to really We don't need that. We need those. We don't need them. There we go. Now the next part, it's just gonna go, uh, get a lot easier from this point on. You're, you're gonna be able to place foundations there. And let's see here. There we go. We can place a wall there, no problem. There's gonna be a little hole, but this is this is such a small hole, you're not even gonna notice it. And now to, to close it off, uh, what, I, what I would say you should do is get a wall on there just in the middle of those two and it's only snapping to uh, to the uh, to the right wall it's not snapping to the left one because if I go over here it will snap to the left one and you're you're gonna wanna just do this and then go to that one and do exactly the same thing let's see if I can do it with the K camera there so these two these two ceilings are gonna look like a, a grid kind of thing but then you know that it's sealed off, right? So let's do the next thing here. We can't close this up. It's it's a shame, I know, but you can close it up in the boat, like placing walls here and there. Let's see if it snaps. No, it doesn't. Uh, good tip. If you're gonna want to build like a nice looking interior uh, with rooms and stuff in your boat, first of all. Uh, there's a big chance you're gonna run out of uh, structure allowed blah 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 stuff so uh, I know on a normal server if you play on a normal server your maximum structure allowed on a raft is gonna be around 70 I think 70 structures or 75 something like that uh, since this is my own server we turned it up uh, to I think like 200 something like that so I can actually build this boat uh, and still place stuff on it but you're gonna you know you're gonna run into problems if you do it on a normal server because you do need quite a bit of walls to look to make it look nice and um, yeah you're, you're gonna have to make a choice there you can make this even higher I mean you can place another another uh, row of walls on there and you can then make the ceilings, but it's gonna cost you every wall you're gonna build, but double that. 
in, in structural uh, structural uh, stuff. So depends on uh, your server settings, really, what you're gonna do. So I'm just gonna keep it like this, so you guys can, uh, you know, can probably build the same one. Uh, you can even, and I'm forgetting to tell you that, you can even take this row of walls off, just delete them all, and get the the ceilings in here and just have a really low boat that's low in the water or something uh it's gonna save you a lot of a lot of structural things so that's that's all up to you really but for now i'm just gonna continue making it like this because i think it looks a lot better um what i'm gonna do and there's a second tip coming if you place these um ceilings and you're gonna fill this entire place up here the pointy stuff with ceilings uh, you're gonna get this problem that if you want to place a wall here it's gonna snap to every single ceiling that you you have in there so if you want to place any walls i suggest you do it right now and not after placing all the ceilings because i want a wall in there but as you can see i'm having a really hard time placing it oh there we go i want a wall there and i want a wall there i even want a wall under that Come on, there you go. So my my pointy bit is now sealed off. It it doesn't bother me anymore when I'm on the inside of the boat, and that's what I want. So like that, and I want the wall there. This wall that you're placing right here, between these two, that's actually gonna cover up that part because the the pieces of wood that are sticking out of the wall, they're gonna slide right in there. So it's actually gonna make it look a lot better. Let's see if we can see it from the outside. Uh, that's really hard. See that? It, no, uh, it's really hard. Hard to see. So it's actually looking a lot better if you do it like that. Let's see if I can do it. There you go. As you can see, that's sealed off. Completely. And the front of the boat, it has a hole, but because the walls are behind it, you can't really notice the hole if you're like far away from the boat. So the boat actually looks pretty amazing with the point, uh, the real bow on it and everything. Only place you're not going to be able to build any walls is next to these foundations here. Uh, for some reason it doesn't allow it and there's nothing I can do about it. I tried to bug it a little bit but it just doesn't allow it. It says it's obstructed and you know, you're going to have to live with that too. Uh, except for if you make the wider build as I just told you not to do. <laughs> if you're if you're gonna build this one more uh if you're gonna place a ceiling right there and you're gonna place a wall under that yes you can seal off the entire boat but as i said it's gonna look weird because you're gonna have a really really wide boat and a really short boat so it's gonna look like a square kind of thing anyways um we got some walls here I want to place, let's see, my driver's seat is right there. I'm going to get some foundations. And I'm going to place these guys back in there. I want to make some foundations. There we go. Uh, I think I need three of them. Yeah. Three foundations. those crafting up and I'm just gonna place them there I'm gonna keep the driver uh, the spot for the driver I'm gonna keep that open and uh, later in the build you'll see why that is but I'm just gonna close this this stuff off so we got this going now um, what else do I want I think I'm gonna I'm gonna go for the hard way here I'm, I Make sure that this is sealed off. It's the most important thing. You're not going to be able to seal this part off as soon as you fill up this part here with ceilings. So we did that, which is great. We can now put ceilings on there. And this is a bit tough, but you can do it with your K camera. You don't want the ceiling to place like that. Not on this row. On this row, you want it like that. So place it on that wall. Then do the same thing for the other one, like that. And now you can go straight from this wall on. Like so and like so. There we go. Now if you get them straight in there, just get this to snap to the other one. It should close up. 
Why do we go straight from here on? Because you can you can just snap them to the other ones, sure. Uh, we go straight and not like like this uh, because of one really important reason. If you want to build anything on this boat, anything else, and you got your ceilings placed diagonally, it's going to be messed up. And by placing them like I just did, just straight like this, you're not going to have any problems placing any stuff on top of the boat. So that's really great. Uh, let's see here. I'm I'm going to close the, the boat off a bit. I'm going to replace this stuff by windows later and stuff like that. But for now, I'm just going to close it off. And I'm going to get my boat two stories high here. And I'm going to place some ceilings. I'm just going to make this build a little bit faster. Because you've seen the most important part. The rest of the boat you can think of yourself, but the most important part, we did that. And that's the pointy end. Or front, even. Uh, let's see here. What am I building? I need some walls. I need some sloped walls, too. Let's go get those going. There we go. Let's get some walls. And ceilings. Very important ceilings. Uh, what are we missing here? Fiber. I do have fiber somewhere. There we go. Let's get the ceilings going. I need more... More ceilings. Why can't we build this? Now it's the thatch. Why is always the thatch gone? Jeez. Ceilings, come on. There we go. I'm really happy with my weight at this point. I'm n I'm not overburdened quick or anything, so that's that's pretty good. Okay, let's continue this build. It's getting dark, which really sucks. Let's. I'm gonna get a campfire because we want to see stuff. You know, actually. I have an even better idea. I'm gonna cut the video. I'm not. I promise I won't build anything else. I'm just gonna make some walls and window walls and stuff like that, and a door frame. And then when it hits morning in Ark, we'll be back so you guys can see the rest without me having to turn up the gamma. So um, be right back, peeps. And we're back, guys. Uh, during the night, I crafted up a lot of stuff. Uh, we got. Uh, a lot of prefabricated things in here. I got a lot of it in my inventory that we're gonna need next. And I got another level up. Which is great. Wait. There we go. So, uh, for the next part of the boat. See here. We got this straight. We got that thing going up. I'm not sure if I'm gonna get it to go up here. I might. Let's just place uh, place this ceiling here because that's supposed to go there. Let's get maybe one there, one there. Now, very important thing: you can place another ceiling behind it. Yes, you can, but not behind this one uh, because there's no foundation in the driver uh, area. Now, you may choose to just put a foundation in there. You you totally can do that. But I don't like it, so uh, I, it's a bit weird if your character is sticking out of a of a floor where you're where you're driving the boat. So, um, anyways, you can place the the ceilings there, but you're not going to be able to place a wall on it. So I don't do it. I'm just going to keep the boat as long as this, and then maybe later put a ceiling on there with some uh, with some ramps. But we're going to see about that. Um, first of all. Let's place some ceilings there, like that, and we have we have quite a big bow right now, and I want to go up from this point on, I think. So we're gonna have to remove that wall, then have another level on this, which I'm gonna make windows, because so I think that looks good. Place a window there. We're gonna remove these walls. Like that. 
and we want these guys. In there, let's see, like that. And now for the hard part here, uh, we need ceilings. I just put them away. That's not really uh, that's not really handy. There we go. Put the ceiling in there, and put the ceiling in there. And that's just to make sure that we can place these guys here. Uh, let's see. Oh, it's flipping out. There we go. And that one. Now we should be able to get uh, another ceiling in between that. Like that. And we end up with this. Now, I need some way to get up there. <laughs> I didn't really think about that one. Uh, yeah, we're gonna have a ramp there. Do I have a ramp with me? Yes, I do. I'm gonna wanna ramp down this thing here, so we can actually... Oh, man. As you can see, we got quite a big inside here. And we're gonna have the driver's seat. That's covered up. You're not gonna get it by, hit by any arrows or something. And you can actually get up the ship here. And what we're gonna do now is... Did I bring them? No, I didn't. Of course I didn't. Why would you think so? Let's see. Let's see. Let's see. We need them. There we go. Get it back on the ship. There we go. And we're just gonna place these guys on here. Let's see. Like that. And like that. Now we can place a nice door in there. Let's see if I can get it to go the right way around. I really want it like this. But I think the doors get weird if you put them like that. But let's just do it for now. Let's just place it like that. And let's see what the door does. Well, it's not too weird. I mean, it's not, I think, not entirely in there correctly, but you don't really notice. What we can do next is not build stuff, but we got to make this ceiling go there. And same goes to the other ones. Oh, man, that went the wrong way around. That escalated quickly. Let's see here. I really want to get this, this one straight. Like that, okay. Now you can see the wall sticking out. And that's basically a thing you're gonna have if you press E when you play stuff. It's gonna, it's not It's not turning it around, but it's also like placing it somewhere else. And that's really stupid in my opinion. Let's look at the boat. Oh, it's actually looking pretty sweet. I think we're doing a great job on this. I might actually be able to get this, uh, this level a little bit further to the front but I guess we'll decide on that later I think it uh, it will look good like this um, now we can still place walls here that's no problem but once again if we place a ceiling there and make the boat even you know look even better let's see here there we go uh, it's not gonna you're not gonna be able to put a wall on it so that's that's a real shame there's just nothing we can do about that Let's, uh, let's get this stuff going, because now we're just going for looks. I think the boat from this side here, it's all good, it's looking good, and I'm gonna get some railings in there, I think. I think railings would look good, and let's get windows, maybe? I think windows would be cool, or doors. Let's just for now put some windows in there. And see if we have some walls left. Oh, we got plenty of those. Let's, put, let's just fill it up for now. Oh. Uh, we're gonna close this off. We might as well. Yeah, let's do it. Let's just close. Oh no. I don't have any windows. 
let's just close up the entire thing and we can always make changes later because any change we do have to make that's just going to be more XP and we're trying to get to max level so we can do the real cool things let's see here I want to get a wall in there but I'm not allowed to so basically we're going to be stuck with these three foundations at the side that's okay I'm not too bother bothered about that some of you might be so um now there's no way for us to get back on the boat <laughs> except if we dive so let's do that and get it out a little bit there you go can we go under it now i don't think we can let's uh let's get camera out of this let's just sail it a bit out there we go so we get, as you can see, we've got quite a bit of room in here. You can't place like big storage boxes, but it, it, it does look a, a lot roomier than most most boats do. So that's pretty cool. we got uh, two stories here that we might uh, even expand one further. So you've got two, sp two stories here also. But you're going to get the problem that this uh, ramp here is going to be inside the place that you're sitting or driving the boat and I don't think that looks really uh, really good so uh, we're just gonna keep it to this one let's get out there now did I bring the railings because I keep forgetting to ring stuff I did build like 15 of them let's see let's get that stuff in there uh, we're gonna need those we're gonna need that I'm not gonna need this uh, we're gonna need the flags. We're gonna need these. And these. And there we go, the railings. I think I might be overburdened now. No, I'm not. You gotta love weight. You you gotta love that carry weight. Let's get in there. And now now it's purely going for visual things. Like that. And like that and we're just gonna do that as far as we can now this looks kinda stupid can we place it here? oh we can't oh that's well, it's not too bad it's just a shame you can't put them on, on ramps it looks so silly I'm gonna place it here because you know why not oh did I destroy that thing? don't tell me I did oh yeah I did Oh no, I shouldn't have done that. We're gonna fix that later. Let's see here. Put you over there. And you. And we're just gonna continue up here. Because in my first build, the other boat that's over there with the, with the sails on it, I actually put window walls in the back here. And that's, that's your preference, but as you can see, it's already three walls high so we might as well put railings there because you can also have too much of the walls and it's just gonna look weird I'm gonna put railings here and I'm not gonna do one layer but I, I wanna do two layers by the way at this point if you are on a normal server why is this not working? Oh, there we go if you're on a normal server this is probably the point where your thing is gonna say there's too, mon uh, too many structures on this platform and I know it sucks but you know you can't do anything about that so if you don't want that uh, you could lose the railings to, if you if you remove these railings that's already 16 things you can build extra on the boat so that that should take care of that uh, you can also remove like I guess some walls uh, on the back there and stuff like that. You can f you can figure it out on your own. Uh, let's see here. I want some more railings. I need like three of them. Because let's get those go. What am I missing? Fiber. It's always the thatch that's gone, but the fiber is also being a shit right now. I know I have a lot of fiber. Just three. There you go. Now we're gonna place that window in there. 
What? How is there? Oh, never mind. Let's get that in there. Okay, last few railings. Like that. And I think that looks pretty cool. Oh, I need one more. I think that looks cool. At the back. I want that there. And we should have kind of a piratey uh, looking ship right now. Now, of course, you can do whatever you want with it. It's all, it's all up to you. But I, I'm, gonna, I'm just going to build it like this. Because I already filled twice, so I want to keep it safe. Now, do we want a big sail here? Or do we want it here? Hmm, that's, that's a tough question. I think we're going to put it there. But there's also going to be another s two sails here. Where it's snapping right now. So I might put it there. Yes, I'm going to put it right here. And let's see here, I'm going to put a ceiling on that. I think we can actually still do that. Yeah, we can. I'm going to put a ceiling on there. And then build like another few pillars on that. Because we're just going for looks here, guys. I mean, I, I, I have a really high um, structural maximum. So I'm not too bothered about this stuff. Uh, about it saying, uh, you know... You have too much stuff on this uh, boat. Let's see here. We want sails. Now I do have four flags, which is not enough. But I had the stuff to make four of them, so I really want to get this as straight as I can get it. And this this is really hard, hard to do. I want to get you guys there. Let's see if it, is it on the line. So zoom in a little. I want it on that line. I think that's right. Then I want it at the most outstanding point. Yeah, we're fine here. Now we're just going to build that. And then if I stay in this camera mode and figure out... There we go. We should be able to just put these together. Now as you can see, if I put it on this line, it's going to be weird. So I already I already messed up there. Um, I might just build three of them because you can kind of put them in inside of each other, so that should be fine. But for now, I'm just gonna build it on the line. Let's see where is the line? I can't actually see this one. Uh, I'm guessing right here. Let's see. Oh no, no, we we just we did it. It's fine like this. Just put it in there. Let them, you know, collide with each other. Is it straight? No, oh, well, the pillar is a bit... You know, we can't do anything, per everything perfect there. I'm just gonna go ahead and put this uh, in there. Like that. Because as you can see, right now it's just a sail, but it's it's off. It's not right. I'm gonna correct that later. But just to show you guys, this looks like a sail. If you put them inside of each other just a little bit. So that's pretty cool. Uh, let's see from the front. I don't think you'd actually notice that it's not in the middle. So that, that that's actually quite fine. Now, this is also hard. We're going to put that on the tip of that ceiling. That's not easy. obstructed it no it's not but I want to get it on the tip like that and now I gotta make sure it's straight and that is really hard let's get you on there why is it not oh man come on help me out there we go look in the K camera I think it's on the point Yeah, let's just uh, place that, and then we gotta go to the other ramp, and hope it still snaps with the other one. 
Sí. ¿Cómo? ¿Qué okay, cámara? Oh, why are you? Oh, that sucks. Okay, that's not gonna work out. Man, I just want to get it in there. Why is this not working? Just do it like this. Get it on there. Then crouch. Then get it on there again. Because if you crouch, the K camera doesn't place it anywhere else. Normally. <laughs> In this case it is. Let's get you on there. K camera. There we go. Okay, so now we should be able to do this. Uh, they're gonna be... Yeah, there are going to be three sills there. So we're going to place it here. Like that. That should be pretty straight. Now all we have to do is make some more sills. And uh, the next the next tier of sills is going to be on top of that pillar. On these wooden catwalks. Uh, let's see here. Can we place that? Oh no, we need a ceiling for that. Ceiling. fiber. Oh, those cost a lot of fiber. That's why I ran out of fiber. Now I know. I, I'm not sure if I put it up there or down there. I think we're gonna go for this. Put it down there. And then have the catwalk stick out like, like that. There we go. And it should be okay. I did I did a pretty good job on the sails on the other one. And I kind of want to go over there and spy a little on how I did it. <laughs> so uh, I'm just going to do that. And I'm going to get some more fiber. Craft up the other uh, flags. And we'll be right back, guys. It's getting dark again, by the way. During the night, some stuff happened, actually. Uh, as I was gathering some fibers, I ran into a new Tyrannodon. Where did you go? I tamed it up. It was a really low level, so... But it's, it's gone. I, it just flew off, I guess. And a female raptor. Which is done. Nice. Come here. Where did the... There you are. Why are you in the water? Why are you doing that? Come here. So I've got two new tames. I did that over, uh, over the night time here. And uh, we should uh, get some more eggs going now. Which is good. Why? Oh, you're you're smart. You're a smart little raptor, aren't you? There you go. Land, please. Land here. Just just do it. Oh well, you're fine. So I got uh, five sails because I went to the other boat and I looked at the sails there, and I needed five more. So I crafted up a few more, and uh, yeah, let's make let's make the boat as it's supposed to be then. Uh, I do need a ceiling from somewhere, I think. Let's see here. We got the thing there. We need one more ceiling. Let's just craft that up. Oh man. These dodos, they're laying a, like an <laughs> exceptional amount of eggs. It's absurd. What? Why isn't this? Stop laying eggs, please. I have way too many of these things. There we go. Put that in there. And get some ceilings going. Okay. So now we should get those flags on there. And uh, create a, a good looking sail. And I hope it works out. Okay, so we should have one more sail on this. So, uh, three sails together. Uh, it looks like one big sail. 
So we should do that first. And probably if I'm going to place it like this, it's going to be the wrong way around. And I'm not sure if that actually matters. Let's see here, because this is not... There we go. Uh, that. Okay, a little bit back. Because I want it to stick out in front of that uh, ceiling. There, I think we could place it like this. So let's just do it. That looks pretty good. Okay. Now for the next one, uh, I actually built the the things already, but I'm not sure how I'm ever going to aim this stuff. This, this is pretty hard. Let's see here. I'm, I'm gonna need three of them, like, as exactly the same as this. You're gonna wanna do that, but then on that top ceiling there. So I think I might have to make a ladder or something. Let's make a few of those. So we can get up that ceiling. And hopefully make something. Let's get that there. That should be fine. There we go. And what we wanna do is place it exactly the same way as the other ones so let's do that, get it here now we want to make sure this is straight where did it go? you can't do this with the flags, normally if you K, uh, go to the K camera and you know, watch it from the, from the outside, if you're crouched it's actually gonna stay like that but it doesn't for the flags for some reason. Let's just place it like this and hope it's straight. It looks pretty straight. And do that. Do the same thing here. Let's see. I want to have my camera straight. Like that. Come on. Uh, yeah, let's place that there. Okay, looks good. Now this one is the hard one. Uh, I'm actually gonna have to turn it, I think. Let's see, what's the middle here? We got one, two, three, four, five. One, two, three, four, five. It should be between these two. Now, it's not gonna allow me to place it, because I'm either gonna be in the way. Oh, we can actually get rid of this, I think. There we go. That makes it a lot easier. Let's see, this should be the middle somewhere. And let's just do it. I think I think this is one of those things, like a band-aid, you just have to do it, get it over with, and hope it's right. Looks pretty good. I think it worked out. Okay, now uh, for the cool looking part, and we, we got one flag yeah, we're missing one flag. The cool looking part is that we, we can get this flag here. On this spot. And get it to go back a little bit. So it looks like there's like some wind or something under it. Let's see here. Let's just try this. Let's go have a look. Yeah, that looks pretty good. That's fine. And now I want to remember this spot. It's just just behind this point sticking up. So we can do exactly the same thing here, but it's probably going to be or you know at another angle because it's not really easy to 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 remember the angle there. I think I was standing somewhere over here. So let's just try that. It's just behind this. Let's just place it. Because if you get that angle wrong, like I just did, you're going to have a hole. You don't want that. You really don't. Because I think you're going to see it. Yeah, you're going to see that. So we've got the angle wrong there. There's no problem. I can make another one. We're going to delete this one. And let's try that again. This time... I want to see if I can use the K camera. Just get it over here or something. 
There we go. This is way easier. <laughs> okay, let's get it like that. And I think that other one is sticking out a little bit. Like this. I think we should be good like this. Just maybe a tiny bit back. I want them to collide with each other. Do we have the good, uh, the right angle here? I think it looks good. Maybe a little bit more that way. It should be fine. Let's see. Let's find out. Yeah, looks good. As you can see, the boat, the boat actually looks like, like, like a ship now. At least I think it does. So that's that's pretty cool. And uh, okay, that's done. Now, of course, there's a lot of other things you can do to the boat. I mean, you can build like lanterns on it or whatever you want to do, like torches and uh, wall wall mounted torches. And I'm going to do all that all that stuff. But I'm going to do it in different episodes. Basically, you guys learned how to build this this part of the boat. And that's basically the one thing that I've never ever seen anyone else do. So yeah, that's awesome. And you can build a cool boat any way you, you'd you like to build it. And uh, I just want to ask you guys, if you enjoyed this video, please leave... Uh, leave a like on the on the video and uh, I, I would be really happy knowing that uh, you enjoyed it and that you learned something and uh, if you want to see more uh, like like these crazy kinds of builds there's gonna be plenty more in the future so uh, you know if you want to see more subscribe to the channel and uh, I think we're just gonna leave it at this I hope you have a nice day guys see you later